Hello, one and all, welcome back to more Let's Play Persona 5 in the I am the Max View Trades, almost botched that intro, doesn't matter, gonna keep going anyway. In the last part, I probably didn't take our uh, current objective as seriously as I probably should, and I feel really bad about that, which is why we're going to drop any and all possible social interactions and jump straight into this palace. We're gonna help Putaba settle, settle things with her, with her inner demons. Potentially, literally, depends on how things go, I don't know, we're gonna be going into a friggin' pyramid. Either way, we need to go to the palace. So, luckily, we've got on here to, you know, talk to her very briefly. And then I guess this is our hideout now, so that's pretty cool. Mm. I'm honestly surprised at the palace this time. Everywhere we looked was just desert. Tragically, it wasn't desert. Oh, uh, yeah. All the other ones until now have just been normal cities outside of the distortion itself. Yep. Thanks to that, we didn't even know we were in a palace our first time going into Kamashitas. Eh, it's still part of the palace, though. The city may not have been distorted, but it was cognition. The palace rulers may have been criminals, but they were social enough to know the city layout. But Futaba probably doesn't. In fact, I bet she isn't even interested in the outside world. Well, to be fair, neither am I. Hence why the whole thing is a bleak desert. Understandable, considering her lifestyle. I doubt many famous criminals are shut-ins like her, though. Hopefully that means we won't have to go through all this desert business in the future. I'm sure that's not foreshadowing. That might not necessarily be the case. Many upper-class citizens travel by limo or plane, so they don't know or care about city life. For real? A plane? Damn, that sounds pretty good. I mean, wouldn't you want to go to a palace way up above the clouds if you could? I mean, we kind of already did once. Also, nah. I think a flying bank is quite enough, thanks. All right, there you go. I have to say, though, the topic of the area outside the distortion is fascinating. Fascinating. Depending on the criminal, there may be an exact replica of Tokyo within their palace. I'd love to examine aesthetics of such a strange place at least once. You don't got a damn thing about art in that head of yours. A damn thing but art in there. Right. But it's true that an observant criminal could have a true... Re reality city in their palace, yes. Although even if such a place did exist, it's not like we'd have any use for it. Alright. So, I guess first things first, I guess we're going to hold a meeting. Because apparently we've we've learned something. We'll need Futaba's cooperation to defeat Mejed. Let's change her heart before the clear, the cleanse. Louis, having trouble reading. The deadline Mejed gave us is August 21st. Looks like we still have a good bit of time left. Okay. Let's sort through our current state of affairs. There's no end in sight right now. Let's try to investigate a little more. Okay. Oh, okay, okay. I, I just clicked the wrong thing. Today seems like a perfect day for us to go into Mementos, except we're not. Let me check our intel. The intel is on an online stalker burning with jealousy because the man she loves has been taken away. Seems he's a Shujin student. Her delusions are really getting out of hand. She's even writing how she's going to kill them. Oh, well, see, now that's a serious problem. I don't remember being told this, and I feel kind of bad that I've forgotten. Because that's messed up. If you don't stop her, she might actually do it. We need to figure something out before that happens. Okay. Fine by me. No objections, right? All right, then. We're good to go. It's unanimous. Okay, all that's left now is to take the target down in Mementos. All right. Well, we will definitely do that, but we're not doing it now. We're going to go to the palace. Let's go. It's time to do some stuff and some things and other things like that. I know not what kind of crazy nonsense is going to happen inside of a pyramid, but... Hey, first time for everything, eh? Whoa! All right. Hey, we changed into our Phantom Thief costumes. At least in our profile art. And that proves she sees us as a threat now. Let's be careful. All right. Let's start today's job. Wow. That costume is very thematically inappropriate now. But I don't really care. He's going to keep wearing the adorable snowman suit. All right. Should be okay -o to go -o. Although, now, why is there... There's, there appear to be things. What, what parts of the map that I can't get to? What's the dilly with that? What is over here? What are you trying to hide from me? Besides this. A ruby! Okay. And I guess... Yeah! Sliding! Whee! And I'm sure my skin didn't get burnt off by the sand at all. I suppose wearing casual clothing does raise a few questions every, every now and then. It's like, yeah... It's like his feet. The skin on his feet should be burnt off by now. My goodness. Okay, well. Time for the pyramid. 
At least the music is really chill. I can dig it. I can dig it. Alright. Also, it seems that the bulk of the pillars have disappeared. Why would you go and do that? That ain't cool. That ain't nice. Don't appreciate none of that. Alright, let's see. We obviously can't go forward. So it still won't open. We might just have to give up on it. No point sitting around, though. Uh, sitting around, though. What do you want to do, Joker? I guess we need to look for another entrance. Not a bad idea, considering how humongous this building is. There have to be other ways in. We will have to investigate every suspicious place we see, both inside the pyramid and out. Uh, outside? You mean we gotta deal with that heat? No complaining! Let's begin our investigation right away. Alright, well, that's the game's way of saying go back outside, stupid. Very well. I'm not great with social cues, but even I can understand that much. It's like, there ain't no reason to be in here, so get yourself out. Alright. Are you leaving? Oh! Come back here. Let's talk for a moment. Oh, okay. I mean, if that's something that you want to do. You gonna be civil about this? Welcome back. I thought I'd never see you again. We're only here because we gotta be. I can't believe you tried to drop a boulder on us. Uh, you want us to steal your treasure or not? Huh. Why don't we make a deal? You wish to proceed further, yeah? A deal, you say? There is a town nearby. I'd like you to take back that which that bandit there stole from me. Oh, uh, yeah, I think I remember seeing a town on the way here. If you bring what was stolen back to me, I'll give you a reward. I'll even tell you how to proceed. Can't you tell us any more details? Anything about this bandit or what was stolen? You'll learn all the information you need to know once you arrive. We'll need to head outside if you want to go to town. We can go when we're ready, Joker. Okay. I guess that's something we have to do now. Interesting. <laughs> kind of odd how that... This is something that we're, we, d we don't exactly do often. So how are we supposed to get to this town other than by cat car? Geez, that's nearby. We could probably see it from here, right? Good point. Let us observe the surroundings and search for any towns that may lie about here. Okay. I guess I'll just... I mean, that looks like a town. Over there. So... I'm just gonna... I'm just gonna, you know... Throw the dice here and say that this is probably the general direction we want to go. Town in distance. Yeah, all right then. There you go. Hey, isn't that a town off in the distance? I mean, that's what it was labeled as, so I'm assuming. Yes, I can see what appear to be buildings over there. Want to head over to town, Joker? It's pretty far away, so this is my chance to shine. Yeah, all right. Let's go sweat more. And cat snowman car! It's a, it's a truly miraculous and wondrous transformation. Always be sure to jump off screen before transforming so nobody has to see the Elderlich horrors that is you transmutating your body into a car. We arrived! This has to be the city Fidabas uh, Shadow mentioned. Looks quite distorted. She said only bandits reside here, but still. Okay... Well, you look like some kind of evil ne'er-do-well. Oh! Ripping a mummy's face off! Okay. I mean, like, a, oh, it's the Sandman. Pretty sure I know. Yeah, you're weak to the electricities. Sweet. I was like, I was pretty sure I managed to get one. Also, I stole something. Forgot to gain that ability. Whoop whoop. <laughs> Works for me. All right, smack smack. Big in the back. There we go. Okay. And have yourself some Mazoa, like that. There we go. And I have absolutely no desire to really talk to this guy, so we're just gonna have to beat his head off. Unfortunate! And land on the face. I'm starting to think it's deliberate, Ryuji. Okay, awesome. I, it's been so long since I've actually, like, been in a fight in this game that I was, like, kind of got thrown for a loop there. Indeed, we must be sure not to uh, get in over our heads. Awaiting Joker's orders. Alright, well, my orders are we're gonna go up behind him, and then I'm gonna rip his face off, and then we're gonna fight him. And, you know, if all goes to plan, we will win. Oh, hello! Let's see. Alright. Week two. Oh, bullets. Makes it easy! Ha <laughs> ha! Ah, let's see, now this is, this is the beauty of always making sure to have every single one of these creatures at least once. Oh, well, that's unfortunate. Farewell! You shall die via punchy punch! Not used to people surviving that. Nice Makes sense, though. I mean, we did. I did only use one tiny little bullet. Didn't really do much. And then the level up. Oh, 
Oh, I'm currently using right. Sandman. Okay, cool. Let's see, no sleep. Uh... Alright, then I guess we'll get rid of that one. For now. I feel like I should probably search through my various personas, see if I can find something a bit, I don't know, better. Let's see. If I could just remember. I got all these people from earlier, that's awesome. Alright, let's see. And then the deck gives us wind. And ice, and all that other good stuff. That's good. And you're just here so I can use social links and what have you. So, I say we go with you. Alright. Good to go. Got to find a bandito. Oh. I got to find a bandito. I'll reveal your truth. And, oh. Alright. Kind of. The camera kind of wigged out a little bit there. Didn't really see anything happen. Okay. So, the first thing we want to do is shoot this dude right in the head. Yes, yes, yes. I do, in fact, look pretty freaking dope. Alright, so then we learned that electricity is your problem, so... BAM! Okay, now it is time for a bro-op! Electric Thunder! Okay, now we do backflips. We always do the unnecessary backflip before we do the all-out attack. I find that funny. It's like, is it truly necessary? Alrighty then. Huzzah, huzzah! Hopefully somebody else maybe will level up. No, okay. Admittedly, that probably was a little overly ambitious. Alright, oh, this looks like a thing. What is this thing? Oh, it's just your uh, typical run-of-the-mill purple fire barrel. Gotcha, okay. Oh, you being sneaky? I can see you through the fence, lady. Alright, let's see. I guess... Wait, isn't that where we came? Yeah, it is. Okay, um... I guess it didn't go this way. And this looks like a suspicious location. Hello! I have to say, the mood of this town is definitely strange. I can't sense anyone around. Except for those, you know, people we fought. Hey! Guys, you looking for something? Excusez-moi! Hey, I thought I heard someone rustling around out here. And here y'all are. Welcome to the desert, fellow trader. Uh, actually, I am tradeless. Thank you. Mm hmm What does he mean by trader? Uh... A trader is generally somebody who takes what they have, gives it with another person, and then they get stuff from them. It's it's exactly what it is. I don't think that word has any other meaning. Unless you're th getting confused with traitor, but, you know, different word. We don't care about your welcomes. You're a bandit, right? Just cough up that thing you stole. Eh, well ain't this interesting, a group of criminals coming after a fellow traitor. Well, you're gonna have to catch me if you want it. What? Uh, you just had to scare him off. Yeah, not your best plan. Me? I'll have time to talk later. Let's get after him. Okay. I saw him vamanos his way right up here. Where are you at? Okay. Other than a general direction, I know not where he be. Okay, well. Luckily, this town isn't exactly the biggest place in the world, so it shouldn't be too big of a problem. I say hesitantly, and I yawn at the same time, as I am perpetually in a state of sleepiness. Um, okay, I appear to have gone in a big honking circle and didn't see anything. <sighs> then my other idea is this. Maybe he's hiding and I need to, like, find his secret hidey hole. Oh, there you are. Hi. Hey, I said wait. You're too slow, moron! You'll never catch me at this rate! Nyuck, 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 nyuck! He ran off again. <sighs> Hurry up and catch him fast. Okay. Is this gonna be like, uh, the Farfetch in, uh, Pokemon Gold and Silver? You gotta, like, trick them into running into an enclosed place. So, like, hello! Ah, you tired already? What a bunch of losers. Grave Robin is a game of stamina, you know. Okay, he's gone away again. Really pissing you out. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We'll never catch him if we do nothing but follow his path. We should corner him somewhere. Yes, yes. Okay, let's use the other square from earlier. We can sneak around him and trap him in there. Yeah, that is exactly what the plan was, girl. Mm. You're lucky I appreciate you so much because I'd be rather offended. I had that idea first. Okay. Now, hello. I got gotcha. you. There we go. Moron. Perfect. He has nowhere else to run now. Let's do this, Joker. Thank you, Normal gaming conventions. 
And I'm not, you know, conventions of games, not game conventions. Anyway, yo, Bandit, what's the matter? Not running anymore? Tch, don't even think about coming one step closer. I'ma cut you. I'ma cut you with my thing. No, no. Give the thing you stole. Ah, don't be ridiculous. You gotta let me go. I mean, you guys came to raid that tomb, right? Why don't we work together and share the plunder? Don't talk to us like we're the same as you. We came here to save Futaba-chan. Now give us back what you stole or we'll smack you up. And although, admittedly, we'll probably do it anyway. So, you want to do this no matter what, eh? Well, in that case, I guess I don't have a choice. I'll just have to explode and transmorph into whatever this thing is. Okay. Thematically appropriate, I'll give you that much. Alright, a raging bird god. Yeah, I was gonna say it looked like Rob, but at the same time, I didn't want to, like, look like an idiot. Okay, well. Okay, well, that... That teaches us that, I guess. Um, okay. How about... Uh, how about... Atomic! Okay. Interesting, interesting. How about fire? I mean, you live in a desert. Alright, neutral. Very well. And, okay, you don't know medium electricity. Nothing. Okay. How about... I don't know. Psychic! Alright. Oh, Brain Jack. Hello. Okay, well, that's certainly a problem. Uh, Hey, remember when I said I was going to go to the freaking doctor and buy stuff? I didn't! Oh my god. Okay, um... Raise attack raw eyes for three... Well, that's actually really good. Glad I took that. Uh, do, 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 do. Stat debuffs. Uh... According to this... I... Wait, mental floss. Cures... No, that just forget. Ah! Uh, cures shock. Uh, nope. I do not really have an option. All right, then. I guess I can only save one of you. So that's a problem. Ow, ow, ow. Okay, this is certainly happening. Ow. Okay, they are pretty much just wailing on each other. Not the greatest. Not the greatest. All right, let's just see what normal slish slashes do. Garudine! There we go. We both reflect that noise, dude. Okay, let's see. Actually, you've got some stuff. Oh, derp! Let's go. <laughs> she has a spell that can fix that instantaneously. I'm a complete and total moron. All right. Yeah. Okay. Looks like we don't really have to take this fight too seriously. Just wailing on him for long enough seems to be more than enough. Marugadine! Oh well, that's certainly not good. And yet, despite that fact, nobody has died. My goodness. All right. Yep, I have, I really, really regret not going to that freaking store. I really am stupid. Okay. Do you think we could probably finish him off in this turn? Unless we miss, I think that is something we can do. All right. Boing. Bap! Okay, please, for the love of all that is good! Alright. Made that fight by the skin of my teeth. Woo! Never really understood. Also, okay, we... A stolen... Papyrus. He stole a font? Okay, we won! Oh, he dropped something. Yeah, the reason we're here. Is this some kind of... Papyrus parchment? Looks like there's something written inside. Hey, no picking out a girl's belongings without a permission! You know, just what the hell's happening in her heart anyway? There's this bandit, those weird voice saying you killed her, and who knows what else. It's a total freaking mess. Futaba's supposed to be the queen of this palace, but even she can't control it? I don't know, I've never seen a case like this. Okay, regardless, we have no more business in the city, so I guess we'll head on back. Although first we're going to specifically go over to Morgana. Let's see. Oop, diorama! Bum -ba -bum, bum -ba -bum. Okay. And thus we are able to fight for a little bit longer. Let's try and make a bit more progress than that. Especially seeing as how we technically haven't actually made any progress, really. I guess with this we'll be able to actually start <laughs> the, uh, the mission at hand. 
Very well. Okay. Oh, well, what now? We go back in and give her the paper. What do you mean you're curious about the reward? The reward is either one of two things. Either access further in, or an ass whooping. Either is totally possible. I'm not going to... I'm not going to rule out either possibility. It's also possible that it is both at the same time. So, you know, sometimes you just got to go with the third option. So, like, send a monster and we'll have to beat it. And then we can move forward or something like that. Anyway... I don't know why this person stole a thing, but here's your thing. Hey. We're back. This is the thing you said they stole, right? Well done. It is yours now! What? What? Didn't you want us to get it back because it's important? Nay. For it is a flippin' map, apparently. That is a map of the tomb, stolen by the bandit to aid in his ransacking of this place. Oh. Why are you letting them just do whatever they want? This is your palace, isn't it? All that matters is the map is now yours. Just come further in and... Oh. What in the... Firewell! What? Okay, hi! And appears we have been dumped into the murky green below. And I'm, I never count... I've never admitted to being a smart person. But I think this is a bad situation! Quicksand, apparently! Although, I mean, quicksand... I don't really think it flows like a river, but, I mean... I guess, you know, in a cognitive world, sure. Quicksand! Everyone, swim! Swim like crazy people! And we all managed to get out of that. Okay. Hey, you guys still alive? Theoretically. Ow. First a boulder than this? Did we piss her off somehow? I don't think it has anything to do with us angering her. I suspect the problem is that she can't control her instinct to push people away from her. Ooh, that's dark. A simple defense mechanism. Considering what she's been through, I don't blame her for mistrusting others. We have to help. Joker, let's save her! We've gotta help Futama-chan open the door to her heart! Alright. I didn't realize this became Kingdom Hearts, but, I mean, if that's what we gotta do, then yo, let's do it. I have no objections, but we should worry about ourselves first and foremost. And that is why you fail, Morgana! Let's go. Come on, let's go look for a way above ground. Otherwise, this place is going to end up our Tomb 2. Tomb 2! The Tomb of Twos. And see, now I'm thinking of, like, Sesame Street. I don't know why the number two made me think that, but there you go. Anyway, punch and stuff! Alright, some kind of mural. That's cool. Oh, some kind of monster. Alright, he has a... <laughs> Luckily, this mummy apparently has been rotting for a little while. Does not seem to have any manner of eyesight. Now, these look new. Yes, they are. Alright, let's use a little bit of psychic power! Alright, that didn't do anything. Alright. Then we'll go with Atomic! Absolutely nothing. Okay, then we're gonna roll with a little bit of fire! Still nothing. Okay, I've only got one last thing I can use! Alright, completely immune to electricity. Good to know. Oh boy! I mean, all right is a relative term, you know? All right, let's see. What about wind? There it is. Okay. Take some of that. Now let's see if I can actually maybe. Okay. You know what? Let's have ourselves a little bit of a of a powwow. Are you human? If you are, then you under should understand me, right? I was. I. Uh, I wonder if this is it for me. If I'd known things would turn out like this, I wish I had found the courage to ask that girl out. Relatable problem. I mean, it's too late for regrets now. Ah, you're right. I knew that without you saying it, even though it pains me to admit it. Oh. Okay, despite being flat on her butt, she seems to be able to do stuff here. Cool. The enemy's mood has improved. What the? All right, I can't say no to a girl like you. Let's hear your story. Uh, you have a moment? I was wondering if you could tell me something for future reference. What was the cause of my defeat? I, uh... I, well, I used a wind spell. I exploited your weakness. Your lack of resolve! That's easier said than dud, but you're probably onto something. And I could just get a muscle drink. Fantastic! This was a bad plan. Great. Now I don't even get the experience. Okay, well, I got some, but still. Not nearly enough, I say! Okay. I don't know why I'm so bad at talking to those dumb shadows. Ugh. Why are they so... 
I just, I don't understand what I'm supposed to do. It seems like the answers are almost random at times. I'm sure there's a system, I just haven't been able to figure it out. I only have to ever- Oh, okay! I only ever have to do it, like, once. For each person, so I don't really get a lot of training with this. Alright, then very well! We shall strike! Alright, oh! Friggin' sweet! Took a revival bead? Gotta use physical attacks more often, not damn. Although I think it only works with Joker, so that's unfortunate. Anyway... Electrification! And then mass extinction. Y'all shall not be throwing no more sand in people's eyes this day. Sandman is, when you think about it, is really kind of a jerk. Like, really, that is his job. He, he breaks into your house and he throws a fistful of sand in your eyes. Like, that's supposed to help you sleep? I don't think so, sir. All that's gonna do is cause severe eye irritation. And possibly actual, like, legitimate damage. Especially if you, uh, if you instinctively rub at it. You gotta wash that stuff out. If you rub, you're just gonna cut your eye up. Oh, and a sward. Okay, well, I'm pretty sure that would go to you, wouldn't it? Uh, yeah, alright. You're not on the team, but you still got a new weapon anyway, so good for you, buddy. Alright. Oh. Navigating this place is actually a whole lot easier than I thought it was going to. Uh, wait. Is that really the extent of this place? Okay. It says I can break this! Oh, okay, it just took a bit there. Okay. Interesting. Maybe that's just not where we're supposed to jump up. Okay, guess we have to go the other direction. My mistake. Ah, take that, Anubis. I don't know what it is I picked up, but it was something. I can tell you that much. Okay, oh, there we go. There's another way up. Hally oop. Hally up. Okay, wait for that guy to turn around. Because I guess he can't hear things either. Like, I'm okay with this. It's a lot easier to sneak up on people in this game than it was in the last one. Alright, you were right. Bip bap. Alright, so this won't kill them, but it will do a whole bunch of damage. Everyone else will be able to finish them off. Punch, punch, kick, punch! Okay. Whip, whip, salad dip. Okay, that takes care of that. So far, the shadows aren't, I guess, shadows, personas, whatever they technically are, aren't so, uh, tough to fight. I'm sure that'll change as soon as we actually, you know, make it in deeper into this place, but still. Either way, level up! It's as if I, it's, it's just what I've always wanted. I, I kind of wish someone got a new skill, but whatever. I'll take a boost and attack stat. Alright, let's see, can I climb this? Yes, I can! Hello. In retrospect, I really probably shouldn't have avoided that fight. Avoiding fights means less money and less experience. And I'm not down for either of that. And... Full frontal! Ha ha! That should never work. I mean, I guess we can turn into like a weird shadow thing, but still, that just should not work. Alright. Boom bow! Eh, eh, eh. Oi. I was trying to remember what these dudes reminded me of, and I don't remember its name, but there was a... F I think his name was like Mac Tonight or, or something. I'm not sure. But he was like a he was like a, a, a person, but he had a moon for a head, a crescent moon, and he wore sunglasses. I think he wore, I think he played the saxophone. I, I can't say this with 100% certainty, but you know... I'm, I'm relatively certain that it, it was a thing. Strong Bad dressed up as it is at Halloween once, so... That's definitely a thing. Also, we appear to have gone in one big, huge honking circle. As it turns out, the way I was going originally would have worked. I'm just stupid. And up a bum Congratulations, on You spotted a shadow. It's not like they are hiding or anything. Okay, let's try this song and dance number again. I wish to enlist your help so that I may have access to all possible personas in the foreseeable future. Okay, let's talk. Now lend me your dang power. Okay, what's the problem here? Let's calm down and talk. Take a deep breath and listen well. What if I was human? Then what you're doing? Well, it'd be a criminal act. I, 
I think I think that's the case regardless. It, it's still a criminal act now, but I unrelated. You want to throw away your life at such a young age? But there's so much fun to be had as an adult. I don't know how that answer gave that response, and I don't know why that response is considered a positive one. I'm just asking out of curiosity, but how are you feeling? I mean, how does it feel to wave your gun at an enemy who's completely lost the will to fight? Um... I don't like it. I was just being sarcastic. Don't get depressed. And I still don't get it. Ah, this sucks. Now's the time to retreat. Somebody, anybody, tell me how the hell this stupid nonsense is supposed to even work. Okay. What about that answer was so much worse than the other answer I gave? And what? You gotta get like, like perfect answers every single time. And the answers are completely abstract nonsense. Found a black rock. Okay. Might as well see what that is. Black rock, a stone that can transmutate. Uh, okay. I'll assume that is something, I guess. Okay, was that just... More treasure, okay. Well, one of these things has got to be able to let us leave... Somewhere, possibly, maybe. I don't flip and know. Yeah, just keep climbing and breaking. Oh, that's not breaking, that's hiding. And we were hiding from nothing. A rusted onk. Okay. That looks to be a door out of this place. I say we go over there. Hey. And then we hide. And then we stealthily wait. I know not where my friends have gone. But I'm sure they'll inexplicably appear once the battle starts, which is really what's more important. And right, now we got a bunch of these dudes. Eh, eh. And there you go. <laughs> That's just so satisfying. Like, oh my head. Because it's such a tiny amount of damage, too. Oh. I guess we're... I guess those two level ups were enough to completely shift it into our favor. All right, cool. Don't have to do follow-up attacks. Oh! Holy hell, at long last, medium electric damage to one foe. Oh my god. Oh. And Goemon is also stronger. Awesome. Okay. So let's see. I don't think I can open this door. No, though. I didn't want to go through it. Go back. There was, I thought this was like, I don't know, they were going to say it's locked or, what? That is such complete and total butt cheese, I cannot even fathom. How the hell was I supposed to know that was gonna happen? Alright. Go. Away. There we go. Word of the wise, if your weakness is bullets, don't even try and bother fighting us. I mean, granted, yeah, we'll all run out eventually, but... It wasn't yet, it wasn't yet, so... Yeah, kind of a problem for you, ain't it? And more level up! Sweet! All right. I guess those, uh... Those Mishima bonuses that I've gotten from the Confidant are starting to actually add up. Alright. As I've completely forgotten... There we go. Luckily, nobody was in serious trouble. I figured I was gonna have to crawl through here for some reason. I'm guessing it's a, a secret? A secret pizza, perhaps? Indeed! Alright, I'll take the thing. And it's a Gale Cape! Okay, I'm assuming that either powers up or reduces uh, wind damage. Would make sense. Uh, Gale Cape! A cape that helps one avoid wind. M okay, hang on a second. Ryuji, what are you doing? You've got the muscle anklet. Okay. A medium chance of evade wind. Like, sounds good to me considering how freakishly weak it, to it is to him. Okay, should I... I can, okay, well, I was gonna ask if... Oh, wait, no, I can. I was gonna ask if I should go down there, but then I thought, oh, well, I guess I can't, I'll except I can, and now I'm fighting another mummy. Except I'm not fighting a mummy. I want to fight a mummy. That sounds cool. Okay, here's the thing. Rather tight. He's already almost out of bullets. There we go. Revolver! That's like, that's some Old West-style shooting that she's doing there. It's pretty awesome. And strike a pose. 
I do have to admit, Makoto's thief outfit is the only one I've seen to this point that doesn't actually look entirely stupid. If it weren't for the mask, then I think it would actually be almost worth keeping. Alas, the mask is kind of a big deal. It's like, what is even the point of domino masks like that? They don't flip and do anything. It's like, oh no, you've obscured your eye, your, your, like your temple and your eye, like, you know, your eyes somewhat. Like, that's nothing. I ain't gonna hide your identity from anything. You get a picture of you, they're still gonna figure it out. Anyway, let me your damn power already. All right, uh, did my horoscope say today would be bad? It's fine, do as you please. Uh, come on, join my team. Okay, did you not understand me? I meant kill me. That's what this was leading up to, right? No, because I want you to freaking join me, you moron. Okay, at least that's really helpful. I'm aware you're a minor, but it would be lovely. Da, 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 da. It's cliche, but we could chat about life. Stuff of that nature. Okay. Okay, where's the option for same age women? Like, I don't know. Is this what you want to hear? Okay, there you go. Huh. <laughs> like, I was just trying to think, like, what answer would be the correct thing to say? I do not have the slightest. Either way, got the Naga. Okay, that's all the information we're ever going to be able to get out of that, dude. Now I can just, you know... I can very quickly okay. and unashamedly just murder their faces whenever I'm forced to fight them again. Alright. Hopefully it's not hard to go... Whoa, hang on. No, thought I saw something. Twas merely a blue light. Hopefully I'm able to get back to where I was pretty easily. And I wasn't about to turn down free loot. Or anything of that such nature. Okay. Oh, right. I forgot. I did a little crawling to get over there. You know, for thieves, I feel like we should probably invest in something to, uh, you know, some sort of scaling equipment. Like, I'd, I'd take a, a grappling hook. Like, from what I hear, like, all you have to, all it has to be is, like, it just has to look like one and it'll work in this place. Sure would save us a lot of trouble. At least that's what I think. Oh. Ain't that like the exit? Kinda surprised how close it ended up being. Well, we didn't really fall that far. Thank God we can finally get out of here. This is all about around a horrible experience. Yeah, I'm sure it's going to be just as easy as that too. Whoop, we've got some kind of horrifying Egyptian mummy dog. Yeah, I saw those rib bones. Whoa. I remember you. Okay, baboon. Reading a book. Gotcha. Let's see. Let's try and become friends with it, somehow. Uh, oh, okay, you're immune to that. Okay, how about that? Nope. Alright, well, at least you're on fire, so that's cool. And also that didn't work. And you've got that going for you. That's a problem. Okay. How about this? Yo, that actually worked! All right, let's talk. Lend me your stinking power. That me gonna be cooked like well done steak. Me not taste good as barbecue. Nerd, me endure this with guts. Though, hey human, hurry up and talk if you want something. Okay, well, good for you. Let your guard down. My guard was never down. Wait, me can see you not have enough levels. Here, me give you. What? You're. What? No. Fine, then, then we're just gonna have to fight to the flippin' death then, aren't we? Uh, define okay. Eh. I guess he was a higher level than me? I guess I should have paid attention to something like that. Right, fine. Free stuff, and I got the experience anyway. So it's fine by me. All right. Although, can we appreciate the fact that that Egyptian mummy dog exploded and turned into a, a baboon? That just seems a tad silly. Anyway, heal, heal, heal us all. Heal us! Okay. Now we are properly healed. As I stealthfully sneak my way downtown. Alright, there's some fools. They can't really get to us. So, oh. Hey, I see a shadow. 
<laughs> I was like, oh, we don't have to worry. That place is blocked off. We can't get in, but they can't get to us. And then I was like, oh, hey, there's actually a door. Luckily, it appears to be like a super important one that we actually have to like activate and stuff. Okay. Where is this? Oh, there you are. Ah, oh, Leo! Haha! <laughs> Got your nose! Well, that's a big ol' stinking pile of sandmen! Alright, fair enough. L I mean, if I'm gonna be swarmed by a large amount of enemies, I'm glad it's something that I know the weakness to and can very easily exploit. I like a so! Ta-da! And then death becomes you! You know, you really would think they'd stop trying at some point. I mean, like, how many people do we have to, like, you know, turn into weird blood-spurting messes before the rest of them get the idea that they're not going to be able to beat us? I mean, maybe it's just a, it's a battle of, of stamina and endurance. I mean, they do eventually wear us down. Anyway, a mind choker. I imagine that is basically like the Gale Cape, but with, like, psychic stuff. Um, mind choker. Oh, no, that's 20 extra SP. All right, and the revenge mirror. 10% chance to reflect physical attacks? I think not. Yeah, I think I'm going to go with that one, actually. I'll take any more SP that the game is willing to give me. Let me tell you. Let's see it. Let's see anything over here worth nabbing? Uh, we could go there. But that raises the very honest and genuine question of what the halabaloo do I... Like, what's all this about? Hello. Hey. Hold on, there's something ahead. Yeah, jerky man. Look how tranquil it is. It appears to be different from the shadows we've encountered prior. Really? Looks just as incredibly messed up as everything else so far. Yeah, it's probably not a good idea to go up against such an opponent without a clear escape route. We should retreat... Okay. Whatever, game. <laughs> Just gonna... I guess... If they're gonna make me walk all the way up here and then say that we have to go back down there in order to be able to like get the thing needed to open the door I'm gonna be slightly agitated by it but do it anyway because I like this game and I want to see it keep going all right now we have naked ladies okay da -da -da. all right light doesn't do anything let's try this all right, atomic energy is not it. I really doubt fire will work. Okay, I was correct. Give him a bit of the electrical zappo resistant to that. Oh, they've got stank breath. Ew, they've got stanky stank breath. Gross. Now he's got the despair. All right, settle down, settle down. Let's see. Ice might work. I mean, you're like cold blooded, aren't you? Hey, hey, hey I was right. Alright, now let's have ourselves a little bit of a powwow. We must talk things over first. I know nothing about you. I know it's odd to say this about myself, but people who know me will say I never let things go. I'm not gonna go easy on you for doing something like this, you know? I'm sorry, prepare for the worst. Yeah, well, prepare for the worst. And that made her angry, of course. Planning and preparing, that's exactly what makes you human so dangerous. Okay, I guess that works regardless of gender. How should I put it? Uh, you're an interesting lady. I wouldn't mind conversing a little. Okay, well, hey, if it works, it works. If you think about it, there's no need to ask someone you've nearly killed to listen to you. Don't you think expecting your would-be victim to be respectful to your words, or receptive to your words, is unreasonable? I mean, I don't think it's unfair. Okay, that worked for some reason. I do appreciate your candor. Leaves me no freedom to misunderstand you, after all. And da 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 da! Okay, at least I got that on the first try. Right, Lamia, otherwise known as Snake Lady. Now she is all up in my brain. Okay, well, let's see, that's the Hermit. And Strength. Do I want to keep this? Wait. When did I get you? What happened to that first thing I got? Hold up, hang on. You? No, where's that? Where's that dude? Oh, wait, no, that's... Wait, now I'm confused. Didn't I... I... Re... Like, Snake Man. Oh, okay, there you are. Naga. Okay. Oh! Oh, okay, okay. 
Empress. Oh, okay. I thought I thought this was the one we just got. Ugh, sorry. Wicked brain fart! Let's see... Uh, I don't need the moon, Arcana. Your power's incredible. That goes up on its own, so there you go. Okay. Get the experience, get the money, get the power, get everything that's needed in order to succeed in life. And thus we move forward! Alright, as I try to fix my dang headphones, sometimes they wig out on me and I can only hear in one ear, and that's no good. Alright, that was easy! Okay. We escaped. Now we need to go back, though. We made it out! Damn, it's hot, though. Okay, a little bit too much information there. Thank you for that. At least we have secured our escape route. We can finally go about exploring this place now. Let's use this as our entrance from here forward. Should be more stable than the front. Very well! Okay, I find that to have been entirely unnecessary in just about every regard. But fine, if we have an escape route. Although, if, all the, if everything respawned just because I left, that's just not cool. It's a very rude game. I don't appreciate that possible idea. Although, it seems like either I didn't notice any of this stuff or... Okay, maybe... Okay, I'm, I'm guessing I just didn't see that. Yeah. Loot doesn't respawn. At least I don't think it does. But, yep, all the monsters are back. Ain't that just fantastic. All right. Okay, yeah, now let's fight this stupid thing. Yes. Brace yourself. This is definitely no normal enemy. Yeah, it's like the yellow guy from before. Foolish grave robbers, you have engaged the guardian of this place. Or palace. Whatever. Hence there shall be no path forward for you. It is time you perish. And despite being already more than an... In <sighs> okay, so instead of being the intimidating, like, beef jerky carnage symbiote monster, you've decided to turn into a sarcophagus. There are many things I do not understand about this situation. Trapped rat! Oh. Okay, a mouse now. She like that. Since when is that a thing? Okay. Interesting. Kind of wish I had that thing that cured stuff now. Instead of... Yeah, okay. That's certainly... That was certainly a thing. Okay. Not sure what to make of that. Um. Like, I don't... Yeah, confuse, fear, despair, and brainwash, and rage. That's a lot of things it can get rid of, but, uh... Mousitude is not one of them. On is rattled! Ha <laughs> ha! Hee hee! Hoo hoo! I see what you did there. Okay... There's gotta be... Something we can do here! Submit! Oh, there we go. Oh, the mouse is actually wearing On's little... Wearing a little tiny On mask. That's adorable. Okay, well, we now have a weakness. And now that's a thing, too. Although... Okay, so... Ice and wind. Alright, fair enough, fair enough. Um... You know, I'm just gonna punch you. Just gonna punch you square in the face. I don't give a single dingle thing. And on remains to be rattled. Is that something that's going to, like, wear off at any point? Or, like, what? Because I'm gonna be perfectly honest with you. If he just has the ability to permanently incapacitate one of my party members, I feel as if that's just not very fair. There we go. Okay. Now we do the flips. And now we do the many punches. Except without on, which is unfortunate. Okay, oh, no, he can, oh, no, no. Okay, good. Who? Did he just call us clown shoes? Who's wearing clown shoes? The character's not even wearing shoes. Makotas are sensible. Oh, on is wearing, yeah, they're wearing sneakers. I think Ryuji's wearing boots. Where are you getting clown shoes from? That's just mean. Now you're just being a bully, you sentient box. Yes, congratulations, Morgana. We're really not in a position where you can snark about things right now, okay? Just keep on doing all the flips. It most certainly will not end it, but, I mean, it'll get us a little bit closer. Alright, summon more naked lady. Okay. Well, at least I don't have to censor them like I did in God of War, so... I appreciate that much! 
And just keep smacking him around. Leave it to the... Yeah, leave it to Joker to exploit weaknesses and stuff. Like so! Alright, then... Dun, 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 dun. Totally running out of SP, but what are you gonna do? Also, I think I froze the box. I certainly hope smacking it around doesn't instantly cure that status ailment. And it did! Awesome, great, glad... That was a thing that happened. I just heard her make a squeak noise, and it was adorable. Alright, fine. Just get rid of the freaking box! And life leech! Okay, that's just... that's unnecessary. And then you did that, and there goes Makoto. Well, aren't you just the worst? Alright, revival bid! Bringing you back! Okay, fine. I didn't think we'd have to exploit weaknesses at this point, because everything seemed so, you know, hunky-dory, but fine. And I don't have enough SP to actually do anything else, so... This certainly isn't good. In fact, we're all very close to death now that I think about it. Oh boy, trap rat again. Stop with the squeaky squeaks! Oh boy. Okay, seriously, just die! Okay, now, please be enough. It is not... Oh, it's okay. A really random crit now. You know, that would have been more helpful pretty much at any other moment in time. Just saying. Anyway, what all do? Glad I brought right. uh, Makoto back, otherwise she wouldn't have leveled up. Right. Now we learned Dekaja. Let's see, nullify stat bonuses? That's way better than Windbreak. Alright, we managed to scrape through that somehow. Let's keep it up and head for the treasure. We should make sure we don't get reckless, though. It's better to proceed one step at a time. Yeah, 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 I know, I know. There we go. On you, some of our SP. Doesn't really matter. Right now, we're just gonna try to do as much as we possibly can before we're really given no choice but to just leave due to not being able to keep going. But I will make progress! I said I would. I don't feel like we've really made much. At least need to ad I at least need to find a safe room. Also a giant bow. I do believe they refer to those as ballistas when they get to that size. Hmm? What's this? Some kind of giant bow and arrow thing? Oh, that stationary weapon back from the Middle Ages called a ballista. Boo ya! You even know about stuff like this, Queen? I guess that's pretty fitting for you. Uh, yeah, what is that supposed to mean? Also, I didn't realize it was uncommon information. Anybody with a passing interest in weaponry would probably have seen it. Anyone who's, like, watched enough cartoons probably has seen one at some point. Hold up, that thing ain't gonna shoot us or nothing, right? Well, there's an arrow in here, but it seems to be broken. On top of that, it's slanted away. Okay, I feel as if that's probably something. And you shouldn't have turned your back on a master thief! All right, now we got a bunch of those dudes. Aren't you the guys weak to wind? Yes, you are. Well, ain't that unfortunate that I do not have the ability to really do much about that anymore. Unless I've got some kind of ice, I uh, know, wind thing? I do not. That's like the one thing I do not have. That is, that is frustrating. I will not lie. Okay, well, I guess we're just gonna have to go ham. The first time I fight these guys without trying to recruit them. And it's a big old pain in the butt. Alright. Electrify. Okay. Fair enough. Fair enough. Should have should have known that ahead of time, but I didn't. Ow. Rude. Also rude. Alright, just everybody everywhere, just go away. What the Is this some kind of counterattack? The hell was that? Okay, yep, top, shut it up. And the choice list! Mm, not a fan, not a fan. Okay, just, yeah, smack them up. Are they weak to anything else? No. They're just straight up neutral to everything. Zayanga! Yeah, that's really gonna work out great on him. Good job. Bap! 
Okay, as long as this dude's... I was gonna say, as long as this dude doesn't attack the, the main character, it'll be fine. Which means he more than most likely was exactly going to do that, and I'm not gonna take that risk! Nope, he's panicking! Punch him! Punch him in the panic-striven face! Where he, he takes more damage when he's when he's panicked. I'm not, not really sure about how that works, but okay. Now, genuine compliments. If only they didn't come immediately after an insult, then it might have actually been emotionally kind of touching. I am now even stronger! Level 30! Okay, not bad, not bad, not bad at all. Okay, first things first, always punch Anubis. And now we've got a large door. This bears the exact same decoration as the door that blocks the Great Stairs. So what, does that mean we ain't gonna be able to open it? No, I think it's the opposite. How we open this door should provide a hint for unlocking the other one. We might find something out if we investigate the area around here. Let's go, everyone! Okay. Um. You think this would do it? Yeah, it's, uh, an arrow loaded, but the ballista is slanted, it won't fire straight. Okay. Yeah, I guess it's not pointed the right direction anyway. But it would have been cool, you gotta give me that much. Alright, looks like I haven't been this direction. Otherwise, I would have punched that sarcophagus, and I would have killed whatever this thing is. Bibbidi bop, bibbidi boop, and gotcha face. Alright. It's just a bunch of these dudes. Not bad. Not. I have some SP back, but not that much. Okay, at least I got my revival bead back, though. Yeesh. The pickpocket skill has procced significantly more than I was expecting it to. I did not heal people before we went into this fight. Not my best plan. Alright, inflicted with despair. Freaking Monokuma up on her. All up in here. No, thank you. Oh. Why you gotta be all like that? Okay, energy shower! If I can cure it, I'm gonna. Okay, if somebody wants to, like, activate a critical or something, this would be the convenient time to do so. Okay, and, alright, great. Glad to see that what I did was entirely pointless in every conceivable way. Okay, you know what? Maybe I'll just stop giving a damn! Let's see, you... you okay. But you're... Yeah, there we go. That's still a problem for you. And Ryuji is despairing. Yes, yes, they most certainly are about to do that. Alright. Everybody cross your fingers! And summon. Are you actually serious with this nonsense? Okay, I guess despair drains SP. That's actually really freaking bad. All right, just eh, some of that. It's something, I guess. Oh, I believe that's the first time we've seen that. Okay, smack people with a paper fan. Makes sense. Let's see. Hey, how about you go nighty night? And I'm actively attempting to try and do these things, and it doesn't work! <sighs> Medium physical damage! Okay, not bad, not bad. Oh boy, oh boy. Alright, fine. I used the last of my SP to help you out there. Oh, the Lamia is panicking, and that one's dishing out the ominous word. Why are you so adamant about making freaking Skull so depressed? I do not. Oh. All right, on play, <laughs> on pulling double duty. Good job. Oh, oh right, ailment susceptibility went up. I forgot about that. That's the whole point of the foul breath. Eh. All right, that fight took significantly longer than it had any right to. But hey, that's a sizable chunk of experience. I will gladly accept it. Holy hell! You learn all pretty. He just learns every healing spell in the damn book. Uh, okay. Um. Okay. I don't think we're ever really gonna need that. Yeah. Okay. 
I don't feel as if recovering a tiny minuscule amount of of health is really that useful this far in the game. All right. Whoa, hello. That's a thing. Interesting. Hang on, I have to punch this first though. There we go. And a reflective panel, apparently. Yeah, you see this kind of stuff all the time in places like this. The light pouring in from the ceiling is reflecting off here, but it's hitting the wall! Uh... And there is a cracked wall! Aww. This wall's all cracked, do you think we could break it? I doubt such a task would be easy, but it might be possible if we hit it with powerful enough force. Okay, so if I'm correct, yep, that happens to be exactly what it's pointing at. Alright, we do in fact get to fire that dang ballista. Fine by me! Time to knock the wall down! Yeah, okay, yep, that's great. Doesn't matter, let's do it anyway. Yeah, okay, let's do it, though. Where- why aren't we doing it? That is obviously the solution. It is pointed right perfectly where it needs to be. Use the freaking bow! What? Okay... What exactly am I supposed to do here, then? Yep, okay. This is where I came from. No point in that whatsoever. Okay, maybe they need to learn that the sunbeam is the thing that we need in order to open this thing, because it's pretty obvious. Nope, okay, so we can't confirm that either. Okay, I, I can only assume it's not letting me do things because I haven't, the characters haven't connected all the dots. Okay, I guess we'll look at the reflective panel again. I see. Uh, yep. Nothing. Okay, great. Fantastic, amazing, stupendous, wonderful, and everything in between. That's cool. Alright, so what the hell am I supposed to do? I know what I'm supposed to do, but what am I supposed to do to make it so that they do the thing that we have to do? This is the only thing we can do. Just use the giant- use the freaking ballista! Yeah, okay, whatever. Use the ballista. Yeah, congratulations, Makoto. You have correctly identified this thing about 15 times. Why aren't we using it? I am legitimately confused. This is also freakishly obvious. Shoot the arrow. It's aimed directly for the flippin' wall. It destroys the wall. Then the, uh, the magical light beam hits the flippin' door and it opens up. Like, what is it you're trying to get me to do? I've inspected all the things. Somewhere. Like, I legitimately am very confused right now. I see. Okay, like seriously, connect the dots. Aww. Yes, we could definitely break it. It would require a giant honking arrow, like the one that's over there. Okay. This is very confusing. All right. What specifically is stopping us from using it? There's an arrow loaded end, but it's uh, slanted anyway. It won't be able to fly straight. Okay, I don't think it needs to to be able to reach that, though. So... I don't have the slightest idea what I'm doing wrong. Um... Alright, well, I guess I'm just gonna be stuck trying to figure this noise out. It's extra frustrating because I know exactly what I'm supposed to be doing! It just doesn't do it for some reason. Alright, well, I'll figure it out eventually, I guess. Oh! Hello! Never mind, hang on! Eh! Maybe... I don't know how. I have no idea how. Oh, hello. Uh, found a big old button! Hey. What's this thing? Come, some kind of button? I think before you go touching that, okay? It might be a trap. Well, I don't really care. Maybe this will shoot the freaking thing! Yeah. And yes, yes it is. Good! In my defense, how was I supposed to know we needed a switch? Last I checked, most ballistas aren't activated that way. Holy crap, that shared the, the, the cockamamie poo poo out of me. This totally was a trap. I'm not so sure about that. Looks like pressing the button has changed something in here. Yeah, seems like it. Yes, there's now light being cast on the door. It's a markedly obvious difference. Alright, let's go take a closer look. Can I jump down? Yeah, I can! 
All right, so now we can just go in. Thank you. Yes. Ah, so shining light upon the door is what caused it to unlock. Hey. Wait, doesn't that mean we can not open the door at the great stairs the same way? That's definitely a possibility. In any case, we should push on. Now, in one sense, we could just solve a bazillion different puzzles to bring this light beam all the way over to where we need it, or we could do the more sensible thing and leave and buy a, like, absolute crap ton of mirrors. I feel like that would work, too. <sighs> Alas, we must simply do what the game wishes. Oh, hello. Uh, there's something written here. Uh, um... Let's see. The light shed by the god of the underworld shall become the sign for those who traverse the pits. What does this mean? Okay, I think it means use a light to figure out the proper way of going across something or else you'll probably die by false floor or something. That is my guess. I don't really know. Now I'm fighting a dog. Except I'm not fighting a dog. I'm actually fighting a baboon and I don't even know what. She of life and death, apparently, is what that is. Okay, also... Oh, you were 36. When I saw it, I thought it said it was level 26. Okay, well, you're level 26. So, I mean, I can try and recruit you if I had the means to do so. So, I guess I'm just gonna have to stab the monkey. It's just... Uh, now, you're immune to that. I know that much. But what about you? How do you feel about atomic energy? You're neutral on the subject altogether. Fair enough. Fair enough. And, okay, I guess we just don't know what it did. Okay, well, you're clearly weak to some sort of magic. Otherwise, I doubt you would have done that. Alright, fine, then let's just focus on the, the stabbing? Um, what? Why, why are you moving faster than us at such an alarming rate? That makes no sense! Okay, if we could just get rid of... Yeah, okay, and now that happened. Ay, 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 ay. Fine. Just keep it going, keep it going. It's fine, it's fine. Just get rid of the monkey! Or the ape. I forget what the- I forget which one the baboon is. I couldn't- I don't think it has a tail, so I think it's an ape. Alright, now, if you'd be so kind as to just- Alright, got a bead, that's cool. Ah, Algadalo, and you used it on the one person that that would have <laughs> did absolutely jack diddly all. Well, I mean, I wanted to recruit you, so yeah, this works out great. <laughs> all right. I like to think that this care this particular persona's name isn't pronounced the way I think it is, but regardless, I'm going to pr I'm going to not, just for safety's sake. Um. I guess we'll get rid of you. You've got a new map, Joker. Cause I gotta get it, otherwise I can't get all the information I need. And I won't be able to figure out what that thing's weak to. New skill! Whoa, new we got Tentrafew, eh? Alright, medium chance to confuse all foes. Alright, well we can get rid of the low level fire spell for that at least. Uh, I keep saying I'm gonna try and use those things more often, but every time I do it doesn't work and I get... ...discouraged, to say the minimum. Alright, so I... Considering all of this SP nonsense we're having trouble with, I guess... We're going to have to let the next safe house, I guess, be our, uh, Temporary stopping point. Is this a safe house? No? Okay. Then what exactly is this room? Um... Hello? Oh, oh hello, there is something here! Okay, but what? Hmm? It's holding something. Wait, where's the statue anyway? Some kind of dog thing? Oh, God of Death, illuminate the thing on my bobber. Ba 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 boo. Anubis, he's got a thing. Yep, this is Anubis, the Egyptian god of the underworld. Seems to have some kind of shining orb. Aww. That sounds kind of familiar. Something about light from the god of the underworld, sure. what have you? Yeah, totally taking it. Indeed. Very well. This may prove to be an object of great import. Mine. All right, fancy pancy. All right, now, uh, why are you even gonna put stuff there if there ain't gonna be nothing in it? Whoop. And now, monsters apparently. Okay, whatever. You wanna fight? Let's tussle. All right, so what are you weak to? 
psychic. Mmm. Ain't that just the bee's knees? Alright, we're gonna have to resort to physical attacks. I wonder if we're gonna get a party member that can actually use psychic powers innately. I'd say Atomic would be something that you wouldn't actually be able to, you know, get a party member that specializes in it, but then Makoto happened, so... I guess I suppose anything's possible at this point. Okay, not bad. Luckily, she decided to use her literally only turn to create a barrier for something that we couldn't even use if we wanted! Hey, that's it! Oh, wait, what? I wasn't expecting that to be an ambush. I was expecting that to be like a, a, a normal exchange. Okay, well. Well, I mean, we're about to... We're about to leave anyway, so we might as well. Let's see. I can't use the thing I need. That's so lame. All right, fine. I guess we'll just do the standard. Whoa, hey, blank card. Freaking sweet. Okay. I guess you guys are weak to atomic energy. Fine by me. And then we'll just get rid of you both before you even get a chance to fight. There we go. Now we just got to deal with you. Bap. Oh, and okay, you've buffed your defense, but isn't it enough to prevent you from dying? Oh, well, apparently not, if this is something that's happening. All right, let's talk. All right, I want you to give me your money. That's Naga within you, this time very well. I give you my full support. And if I'm not mistaken, you want money? Hell yeah. I'll take what I can get. I ain't about to cause... I, I mean, I could have killed him too, but eh. He actually decided to, like, you know, just... Hand me stuff without any fuss or muss, which is something I am deeply appreciative of. Let me tell you. Okay, that takes care of that, I guess. And then we all oopsies. And we punch the thing. Eh. Always punch the thing. Okay, oop. Tally oop. Tally oop. And more dudes. Okay. And I gotcha! Somehow, I'm, I'm, at this point, I'm literally running up right in front of their eyes, and they just do not seem to notice. And we do not have any ice magic. This is a problem. All right, I didn't want to use this, but, like, we really have no choice. It's clearly going to be... This better not there better not immediately be a safe house that we can use to leave immediately after this fight, or I'm gonna be pissed. Alright, we just have to survive this. Foul breath. Very gross. More foul breath. Okay. And a third foul breath. Okay, well, we're all very susceptible to ailments, however, you seem to have neglected the fact that you are all very much susceptible to the death. So, yeah. Maybe you should have used that turn actually, you know, doing something. Instead of, you know, planning to do something. And, oh boy, yep, there's another. Okay. Alright, you're the thing that's weak to psychic energy, but you did just create a barrier, so that's not possible anymore. Gotta relax, Jill, though. Luckily... Physical attacks really do seem to work just fine against you. Assuming we actually make, you know, any form of damage. You know, contact is kind of necessary when it comes to a fight. Anyway, bang! Boom! Shack it like a boom! Don't forget this feeling. Okay. A spectacular victory. If nothing else, I do feel like we're getting a lot of experience and money from all of this. Plus a couple of new personas and the like. All in all, pretty good, pretty good. Actually, in retrospect, leaving would be a good idea. That would give me a chance to actually go to the freaking doctor so I can actually make use of all those freaking mm, conf confidant links. Get myself my discount up in here. All right. And what have we here? This room looks a lot like the one we were at. And okay, there's a second one. Hello. Whoa. This statue is the same weird dog thing as before. And look, it's got one of them gems too. The god's name is Anubis. It really isn't that hard to remember, Skull. So, you think we should take it? Yeah, I guess we should. Yoink! Alright. I was really expecting, I don't know, something negative to happen. Usually when you take, you know, like, 
artifacts from pyramids and stuff, traps usually activate. Wait, did I just seize a wind spell? How'd I do that? Maybe it's in card form? That makes sense, I guess. Aha! Your magic attacks that you haven't been using are now useless! What will you do now? Continue to wail on me physically until I die? Oh yeah, I guess that is your plan. Well, I didn't think that through, did I? Aye. These creatures may be powerful, but they lack any form of strategy. Granted, admittedly, my strategy is currently just wail on them till they stop moving, which isn't a really eloquent strategy or anything, but still. I mean, it's still a strategy. I'm actively not using things that would, you know, not work. That would be a bad idea. That would be a bad strategy. And yeah, I guess that was a skill card. I did not realize you could take those from things. All right, All right cool. Okay. More punching. And anybody who can heal us up, please do. As I flip the switch. Alrighty, alrighty, alrighty. Whoop! Hey. Is that? Indeed it is! The door to the Great Stairs! That means we are directly above where we ended up after coming through the front entrance. Okay, that's good. This thing's kind of facing the wrong direction, though. So... Mm -hmm. uh, don't this look familiar? You know, back from when we were all opened that door underground? We had to shine light on that one to get it open, right? Do you think this is the same mechanism? Well, considering it looks exactly like it, I honestly think that's kind of a stupid question, and I don't know why anybody said that. Oh, there's a cavity here. Looks like there's something might fit inside. Oh, Anubis stones. Right, it'll illuminate the path and whatnot. Fair enough. I feel like this is probably going to be revisited and more complicated next time. That feels like an introduction to the puzzle. And... Da -da -da -dun. There we go. Right. Whew, that's progress. So, shining light is what caused it to open. That's the same as the door underground. We can't lest on, we can't re lest on our laurels. Rest on our laurels, though. Let's stay cautious and proceed forward. Okay, so maybe this place doesn't actually have safe houses so much as it has the fact that you... You just open up the main area. You go through an area, you get a little bit further until all the doors are opened. That would make sense. Okay, fair enough, fair enough, fair enough. Okay, well, as much as I would like to continue going, and I actually very much would because it's a, I feel like I'm wasting a day by not actually being able to do anything here. <sighs> I, we don't really have much SP. Don't have much in the way of healing items either, due to my, you know, general incompetency. So, tragically, I guess this is where we're just gonna have to stop our expedition for the day. This really sucks. I was hoping to get more done. Yeah, that feels like we did basically nothing. We got some exploration done, but I don't think we're really at a turning point yet. Are you serious? I thought we did more than that. Well, I guess this means we got even more reason to come back soon. Don't worry, guys, we'll be going back in immediately tomorrow. You never see it come back.